Game day today, conference play starts, Kentucky versus Missouri. Uh, conference play is always fun, a lot of upsets happen during this time of the year. Missouri's 8-4 and four on the season. They play with a bunch of toughness to them. They're really strong in a physical team. Uh, so that's going to be good to see if Kentucky's bigs can match with theirs. Missouri's big men aren't as good as what Levels were, and Kentucky handled their big men pretty well. So that should be good. Uh, Kentucky last year lost to Alabama in their first conference game of the season. It was a 12 o'clock Saturday game last season, and we lost. So hopefully we don't start with the same note. Luckily, it is a home game. Hopefully we start off conference play on the right foot, and we just keep on going from here. Let's go. Let's see how it goes. Missouri is out three early out here. Hagen's the alley-oop to Richards, and he throws it down for the first bucket of the game. Let's see if that can get going. That was almost three minutes of scoreless basketball. They need to get it going. Kentucky playing with absolutely no effort right now. It's one on five, meaning Nick Richards is the only one that came with any effort. Quickly puts up a three. No, Richards is there, and he gets the N1 to prove that he's the only one with any effort right now. 10-6, Missouri. He's going to try to go to the free throw line to finish off the three-point play. Khalil Whitney just cannot guard anybody as he just gave up another bucket to another Missouri guard. He is struggling this year. It's it's bad. 12-7 Missouri. Kentucky just can't catch a break. Richards, the only guy that came to play, knocks down another jumper. And he has all nine. 17-13. Missouri still on top. Nick Richards has 11 out of the 13 for Kentucky. The only guy really with consistent energy. Let's see if that can change. Crowd's getting into it a little bit. They set a little ball screen on Hagens. Richards helps there. Tyrese with the closeout. This guy's going to try to drive. Nick Richards sends it back. Loose ball. Richards picked up his own block. Now they're out and running. EJ to Ashton. Ashton with the pump fake. He goes down. Lux maybe got away with the travel. Steps through. Gives it to Richard. Richards attacks late. Gets foul. And one for Nick Richards. 15 or 13 on the day for Nick. And he's going to go to the line for a three-point play. What a guy. Kentucky's trying to get a deep fence to stop here. Missouri on offense, 17-16, Kentucky. Missouri looks a little flustered. Pins him with the ball. EJ's guarding. Jabs out to his right. Now he attacks right. Good defense by EJ there. Guy gets away with the travel. Hagens gets in the passing lane, steals it. Now here comes Kentucky in transition. They're out and running. They're on a 7-0 run the last two minutes. Quickly wants to give the Cats a lead. And does! 19-17, Cats! Here comes Kentucky in transition up three at the four-minute mark in the first half. Hagans quickly in transition. That's a heat check. Knocks it down. Cats up six early. Nick Richards' momentum wakes up the rest of the team, and they're up six. Big shot there from quickly. Kentucky starting to shoot the ball a little better. Still mostly the Nick Richards show, but everyone else is waking up a little bit here. Quickly to Hagans. Hagans looks. He's going to get a screen from EJ. He takes it. He's got room. Tough little floater there. Oh, it's an alley-oop to Richards, and Richards puts it over for two. What a half by Nick Richards. What a game. 16-7. and seven. He's on pace for a career high. Let's go. Kentucky's got some momentum up 10 here in the second half. Came out with some urgency. Missouri got hit with a technical for a stupid play by one of their guards. Now Kentucky's trying to take advantage of it. That looked like a travel. No call. Sestina with the steal, though. Here comes quickly. He's going one on or two on two. Gets fouled. Count the bucket and one. He's going to go to the line for a three-point play. Largest lead of the game for the Cats. Up 12. And the third best free throw shooter in the country is going to try to capitalize on the three-point play. Kentucky looking good early. Big second half run to start up 14. They're going to go to Sestina in the post here. Kicks it. Cross court. Tough pass to make. Gives it to Maxi. Maxi down the lane. Tough floater. Gets it to fall. Nice pass by Sestina. And good floater by Maxi. Three for eight. But Cats up big. Maxi screen from Richards. Looks. Could Nick take a three? Maybe no. All right. One dribble. Oh, little Euro step. Oh, and he gets the roll. Little Kareem Abdul-Jamor there from Mr. Big Seven Footer from Jamaica. Nick Richards ties his season high with 21 with the little English on it. And the Cats up 14. Let's see. Here we go. Oh, Nick sets it back off the backboard. Send it back, Nick. Quickly gets fouled. All right. He's going to have two. Nick Richards looks like, you know, not a lottery pick, a first overall pick. What a guy. Kentucky up 12 here, just trying to close out the game. It's what they've been struggling with lately, but let's see what they can do. Hagen's going to attack the lane. Looks a little out of control, but he knew what he was doing as EJ throws down the alley-oop. Good pass there from Hagen's. A nice finish from EJ, and the Cats up 14, 248 remaining. Cats win a big game here against Missouri. Boys look good. Um, you know, after their first week of just full practice and everything, they looked pretty good. And, uh, yeah, the only bad thing was Ashton Hagens looked to uh, maybe have suffered a little bit of an ankle injury. We'll have to see uh, later on that what it is. But he left with, like, a minute left in the game. So it's very frustrating. So we're just going to have to see what happens. But 
yeah, but I'll be at the Kentucky Georgia game, so hopefully a vlog comes out of that. But good win, progression, and yeah, let's go. Big win, start SEC play that's better than last year, so go Cats.